and she look good, and her cooking good. You niggas wish they would, you niggas wish they could. She love Megan good, provided like Megan the style. She got on top and you know she be wildin'. Grown ass woman, no childish. Got the bag in the juice, she be stylin'. Pack it back, take a trip to the islands. That pussy good, and don't come with malice. She not awesome, but yeah, she got power. Hey y'all, it's your girl Danny Simone, the real Danny Simone, coming to you with medium consistency, you know. It's been a couple weeks, I know, since I posted my last video. I do apologize for that. Uh, per usual, life has been life in, and we've been having a lot of storms here in North Carolina, so the electricity and the Wi-Fi just hasn't been letting me be great. But today, I am back with a uh, project slash public housing apartment tour for y'all i've been seeing it trending everybody's been doing it and i'm not ashamed of my little apartment because it's big and it's cute and best of all i ain't got no roaches okay so if you are new here welcome if you are a returning subscriber thank you for sticking with me as i navigate all these trials and tribulations to get back on this platform and post okay <laughs> Make sure you like, subscribe, comment your favorite part of the house. I'll show y'all the master bedroom and master bathroom last because those are my two favorite places in the whole house. Stay tuned. So I'm outside. Let's go inside. Okay. This is my living room. Let me make the lighting a little bit better for y'all so y'all can really see. So this is the entryway from the front door. As you can see, that's where I just came from. I did switch these bulbs out for white lights because if you know anything about public housing or living in the hood, you know they always give you those dusty yellow lights that make you feel like no matter how much you clean, your house is always dirty. Um, don't mind the trash. It has been raining. That is going outside, okay? Judge your mama light switch for this hallway right here that does not work yes it was at one point alarm system but like i said it don't work so here we have me obviously no makeup no nails no lashes there's my living room in the back i actually got this mirror my best friend found it for me on a moving job so i don't know where it came from but i do know they have them at target it is 28 inches around so i will try to link that for y'all in case y'all want to buy entryway table actually came from Amazon. I did spray paint it. It was originally white and gray with white handles. I spray painted it this pretty turquoise color, gloss enamel. I spray painted the handles gold. I left the drawers as they are. We'll start with this chair. I love everything about this chair. A beautiful olive green velvet material. This pillow I got from Amazon. Beautiful, very comfy to sit in, gold legs. Um, again, that is from Amazon. This pillow cover is also from Amazon. Up top, I have colorful, bright pictures. This is canvas material. It is actually floating in the border. So cute. And they're huge. I think they're 24 by 36 each and they cover majority of this wall next to my TV. That picture, you see what it is. I really don't have to explain. That is a 53 inch if i remember correctly from walmart uh playstation 4 they don't even make the white ones anymore i got that discontinued from amazon three or four years ago two controllers very much fake plant in a gold stand that i also got from amazon plant is also from amazon let me show you these curtains up close because you can't really see them and the color is not really doing what I needed to do with this lighting. I do apologize, but these are also from Amazon. I have one obviously on each window. I'm big on getting my deposit back. So I didn't drill any holes in my walls to hang these curtains. So that's why they don't quite fit the window completely. I used the no-no brackets. Curtain rods are from Amazon. It's literally just sit on the top of your mini blinds and you sit the rod inside of them. I got crafty being bored one day uh, a couple years ago and put wallpaper inside of my shelves on my TV stand and it came out so cute. Far from perfect, obviously. You can see one of the imperfections right there, but that's okay because it looks good from a distance and that's what's important. Moving on to the couch, I just got this cream off-white throw blanket with fringes. 
I've had this navy blue velvet couch for at least five years, I kid you not, and it's still holding up. I have two dogs and you can't even tell because again, I take care of my stuff. It's not where you live, it's how you live. Up here, I have just some random decorations, a little colorful dream catcher to match everything I have going on. These pictures are all from Amazon. Specifically, these two are 11 by 14. This one of my girl, Frida Kello, is uh, I believe 12 by 16. And that one is also 11 by 14. This lamp shade, because this lamp is actually a floor lamp. It did originally come with a white shade, but once I got settled in here, I was like, I really don't like that. So I also found the lamp shade on Amazon as well. All these pillows are from Amazon. As you can see, I have a thing for velvet. I just think it looks so much nicer, so much more classy. Moving on to my coffee table, I have a little fake plant situation and a book that I also got from Amazon. I don't know what size this table is. I feel like it might be 35 inches around because it's pretty big actually. Super cute. I've also had this table for forever. I just really take very good care of my stuff because I don't like having to repurchase furniture because it ain't cheap, okay? This area rug is an 8 by 10 So pretty and super soft. It cleans well. Colors are actually as bright as they appear on camera. So those are the lights you guys saw earlier. Um, I did say that I'm trying to be more consistent with my channel this year. So this is where the magic happens. This is actually a whiteboard that I just write my ideas as far as what kinds of videos I wanna film and what my goals are for the week. It helps a lot. As you can see, it's framed in gold. I am a gold girl. I don't really care for silver. So there's that. Desk is from Amazon. The riser is from Amazon. The gaming chair is from Amazon. The test brand. Uh, I am a very solid girl. BBW, a little over 280 pounds. It holds me just fine and it's actually quite comfortable. So on this side, I have just a shelf for storage from Walmart. I will try to link that because I forgot there are some things in here that are actually not from Amazon like these picture prints that I got. I thought these were so cute. They definitely represent me and everything that I stand for. How cute are those? The gold frames are from Amazon. So there's my main screen. It's asking me for my password. So if I put that in, then as you can see, it turns on both monitors. There's my camera. That's actually the camera that I used to use to film, but I'm using it as my webcam for streaming now. Um, please make sure you follow me on Twitch at player one bay, player one underscore bay, B-A-E. And I have my RGB microphone, so cute. So that's also from Amazon. Literally everything on this desk is from Amazon. RGB keyboard, matching RGB mouse. This mouse pad is also RGB, but it's not plugged up right now. The laptop works too, but it's charging right now, so I'm not gonna turn that on. And I got my key lights. They're very bright and I already have hella lights going on in here. So I'm not gonna turn those on either cause it will blind all of us, but you get the picture. <laughs> Lastly, my other gaming chair, which really needs to be replaced as you can see. All this ass has it looking like, I don't even know. And again, this is actually supposed to be a dining room, but I don't eat at the table and neither do my kids. We never really have. So it just worked out better for me to use it as a content creation area. All right, y'all, so this is my kitchen. Please excuse the lighting. I really can't do much about that. Isn't it so cute? Here I have my Oster blender. That is also from Amazon, paper towel holder from Amazon, dish rack and towels from Amazon. This picture here was actually gifted to me by my older sister. You can see the theme is pink, navy blue, gold, and turquoise. I treated myself to a new knife set. I've never had one before until I moved in here. And a pink and gold utensil set. My air fryer is definitely old, but it's still kicking. So there she is. All my spoons and stuff are currently in the dishwasher, so don't, don't do that. 
I do have a dishwasher and a garbage disposal. Um, the cabinets are pretty beat down, but again, I don't have roaches, so you, you gotta take the good with the bad, you know? And from here, you can also see the hallway from the front door and a clear view of the living room. So when I'm in here cooking, I can turn around and watch a little bit of TV if I want to. And so from here, down this hallway is the laundry closet. There's my thermostat. You know you're in the hood when you got a thermostat look like that. All right, so here is the laundry closet. Just a basic one shelf laundry closet, washer, dryer. Those are my baby girl's clothes sitting on top of there because she don't ever get her stuff out like she's supposed to. So light bulbs, laundry pods, because I prefer those over the liquid. It's just less messy, you know? Um, spray paint, as you can see, there's the culprit for the front porch <laughs> and the knobs on all my drawers, which again, you will see in a minute. Um, and I keep my blankets and spare pillowcases and stuff up here just to keep them out of the way. It's just less aesthetically pleasing to have a bunch of blankets in your closet and whatnot. So pretty basic, but it works for us. And so from here, we are on the kids side of the house. So there's baby girl's room. There's my son's room. We'll visit them in a minute, but let's check out their bathroom first. So. They have some cute little pictures hung up on their wall, pretty basic, but they're kids and they don't really keep their stuff clean. So I just tried to spruce it up a little bit, but I think it's cute. They got their disinfectant wipes over there in the corner. I tried to get everything off the countertop. So I gave them a little storage cart to keep their toiletries and stuff on. They have navy blue towels, wash your hands, brush your teeth, shower curtain, rainbow colors, cute little yellow trash can, loofahs and such, you know, regular bathroom stuff. From here, I guess we'll go visit baby girl first cause she's the most prepared. So there she is. Say hey, boo boo. Hi. <laughs> so this is baby girl's room. So cute. If you follow me on TikTok, you've already seen this. I recently did her a room makeover for her birthday. She turned nine this year. So she deserved something new in her room. And TV is actually from Walmart. These pictures and this little rainbow thing are from Amazon. The shelving unit and all the inserts are from Amazon. This chair was actually gifted to her by her auntie. Pom pom garland from Amazon. That picture is actually from Hobby Lobby. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find that or not, but I'll try my best. Clock is from Amazon. I think the tablet is also an Amazon Kindle, if I remember correctly. Dresser from Amazon. The whole bed, bedspread, Amazon. Everything in this room is from Amazon. Amazon gets all my money, y'all. All right, y'all, we're back in the hallway, uh, getting ready to go into Sun Sun's room. So here's the doggies. There's Ocean and Atari. Hey y'all. Shut up. I had to get rid of the dogs for a second because they wouldn't let me be great. But here is Sun Sun's room. The blinds are obviously fucked up because the dogs tore them up. I am gonna replace those. Don't do me, okay? The overview of his room. He is clearly a gamer as everybody's son is. I'm a gamer as well. That's why I have a PlayStation in my living room. And he has to keep an air purifier going cause you know, teen boy smell, gamer boy smell. His white gaming chair that desperately needs to be replaced because it has had it by this time. His gamer desk. These pictures came from Amazon. This light. So cute. It's probably one of my favorite things in the room and it's USB powered. So it's hooked directly into his computer. It also came from Amazon. Purifier from Amazon. In these canvas pictures, I actually made them. They came as prints, but I had canvas boards already. So I literally just super glued and stapled them to the boards. And they came out really nice actually. Nintendo Switch, the case. Amazon A-L-E-X-A, -E can't say her name because you know she'll start talking to you. Dresser from Amazon. And then his little gamer boy bedding, so cute. This is a full size bed and it actually fit right in between that wall. Dressers for extra storage. He had to get a lamp, y'all, because 
I don't know what's going on with this ceiling fan situation, but when I took the bulb out to try to put a bulb in, um, I think it takes like mini bulbs or something because no actual bulb will fit in there. So I had to get him a lamp in order for him to have a lighting source. Uh, again, this is public housing. You get what you pay for. And he doesn't have a walk-in closet, but I mean, it's big enough. It has sliding doors. So he's got plenty of room in there for all his stuff. As you can see, he's got a lot of clothes and he has a mini hoop on the back of his door. So we're back in the hallway. I guess I'll take y'all on the balcony. It's probably a mess right now because it has been raining like every day for the past two weeks, but I'll just show y'all anyway. So here is the balcony. Everything that you see out here is from Amazon. Ashtray, tray from Amazon. Um, I'm not gonna lie, the patio seating itself is a gift from my sister. There's a bug zapper, gotta have that. Egg chair from Amazon. They have their little area over there where they go tinkle from time to time when we're outside chilling. It don't look that bad, surprisingly. I guess the rain didn't do a whole lot today, but normally I have to sweep before I come out here look at him get your head in here come on crazy tail so so here's the view of everything from the patio door and now we're heading back towards my room look at these niggas they so nosy <laughs> so just real quick i wanted to show y'all um this is just the closet right in the middle of the hallway right across from the front door i keep my walking pad my winter coat, my weights and stuff, everything that I don't use on a frequent basis, which is really sad to say, I should be using that on a frequent basis, but I don't. Uh, but yeah, carpet cleaner and vacuum cleaner and my running shoes. And then from there is my room. Open this up. Ta-da, y'all. And everything in this room is also from Amazon. I am an aspiring interior decorator. That is one of my passions. So I did what I could with this space. This room is actually really big. So starting with my gallery wall. Now some of these prints I got from Amazon. Some of them I got from Etsy. As you can see, this is the dresser that I was painting on the front porch <laughs> because it literally took me three coats of this paint to get it glossy like this, but it actually came out perfect. and. Uh, it was all white at first, but like I say, I wanted something different going on in here. So I painted it blue, painted the handles gold and left the drawers white. Fake eucalyptus plant came from Amazon. The book is from Amazon. That thing, I don't even know what it's called. It's from Amazon. I think it's a like Jack. This candle is actually from Walmart. I'm never going to light it because it's literally for decoration, but it smells so good. This lamp is from Amazon. This print came from Amazon. This one behind the lamp, let me move that so y'all can see. This one came from Amazon, it's really pretty. That one is from Etsy, 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 Etsy. This one is from Amazon, this one is from Amazon. Frames are from Amazon. Redid this wall probably 10 times, I kid you not, before, <laughs> before I got it exactly how I wanted it. So yeah, but I think it came out really nice. I actually wanna get a plant, like the one in the living room to put here in this corner. This picture, this picture and this little boho decoration situation all came from Amazon. The frames came from Amazon. Headboard, lamps, nightstands, A-L-E-X-A, fake plant, books, all came from Amazon. These nightstands, the only thing I don't like about them is they're a little short, but I mean, they still work, so it's all good. This area rug, a nine by 12, if I can remember, the colors are so bright and pretty. They look exactly how they look on camera. This bench is from Amazon. It's blue velvet with gold legs. We have our olive green velvet blanket. Those two pillows came from Amazon but the one in the front came from Etsy. So I'm not sure if that's still available, but they do have some that look very similar to it on Amazon. So I'll make sure I link that one just in case I can't find the original. And of course we just have the same thing going on the other side. And then I have this huge 
full body mirror that I got from Walmart so long ago, probably like five years ago. I promise I have looked, I cannot find it. I do apologize, I won't be able to link this for y'all. But um, they have some similar ones on Amazon. I'm actually gonna be replacing this mirror soon and putting it probably in my content room and getting another one with an arch at the top, the illusion of more space in between the windows. And then I got this thing here from Amazon as well. My TV, I think this is 50 inches. Um, this is the same dresser as the other one, but the other one is white and blue. This one is just black. I didn't change anything. All I did was spray paint the handles gold. So it really ties everything in together. And then I also have a walk-in closet. Now, I know it's full. I really don't have that much stuff. Uh, I don't know what to say. Y'all can think what you want, but every time I get ready to go somewhere, I struggle to find something to wear. Yeah, I mean, it's a good size. Um, the shoe situation is a problem. Obviously, I'm trying to find a solution for that because there's just not enough room in here. But I mean, I'm in here. Hats hung up on the wall. So it's definitely a good size for a closet. So from the closet right here is the door to my master bathroom. Look how pretty it is in here. Oh my goodness. This is probably my favorite room in the house. The only thing I don't like is that when you turn on the light, the fan comes on automatically. But again, we're in public housing, so there's going to be little quirks and things that I have no control over. But it works for me. This all came from Amazon. The towels are from Walmart. This plant specifically, uh, this one, is from Walmart. This is from Amazon. This picture is from Amazon. It's just like the ones in the living room, but smaller. Shower things, shower curtain and rings from Amazon. Caddy from Amazon, loofahs, my body wash, everything is from Amazon. And then I also have one of those carts like the kids have in their bathroom, but this one matches my bathroom. This rug is from Amazon. It's super soft and it's washable, y'all. So cute. Toilet tray from Amazon. Trash can from Amazon. This rug is also from Amazon. On the actual countertop we have a collection of things i just tried to make it aesthetically pleasing victoria's secret bare vanilla if you don't wear this what are you doing it smells so good waikiki beach coconut by bath and body works also if you don't wear that what are you doing so logically these are two different sizes these came in a set of two this one is separate. That's why the sticker don't really fit, but it's only me and one other person using this bathroom, so I don't really care. Uh, but yeah, these came in a set of two. The labels came with them, but I wanted something else for my lotion and I didn't want to spend $20 extra for one additional canister. So I just got a smaller one and put one of the labels from these on it and it worked out fine. I have another picture just for decoration and then cabinet space. Uh, keep all my extras and such in these medicines in the top cabinet and then in the bottom cabinet extra towels extra loofah extra washcloths and toilet paper all right y'all as y'all can see i'm back in the living room getting ready to chill for the night thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the house tour as much as i enjoyed filming it for you guys like the video share the video leave a comment let me know which room or item in the house was your favorite if you have not already subscribed make sure you do that because i do have more bangers coming like i said i'm on my consistent tip this year okay so your girl will actually be back this weekend with a very important update video you don't want to miss Make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss it. So with that being said, I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.